Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, Michael Palmazano here, and uh, new guitar. PRS sent me the new uh, Silver Sky SE, just pulled it out, checked the tuning, pretty much on, tightened it up a little bit, and um, uh, I just wanted to hurry up and make this video. I was um, in D.C. to see Corey Wong. Corey, thanks again for inviting me out. Had a tremendous time. Uh, and Sierra Hall was with him, uh, and Antoine, and I got to meet uh, Sierra, uh, before she went on stage and I went backstage and I talked to her and I just wanted, I told her, I said like, I I'm a huge fan of yours. Bluegrass changed my life, right? It changed my life and I'm so excited to see you. And of course she goes out there and absolutely crushes it, crushes it. And when I meet her and she's got this glow about her, right? Like everything about her is, is rather angelic. Um, it's, it's true. Uh, Sierra, you know, it's true. And I, uh, <laughs> I um, told her, I said, I think I've done a video on you before, but I am not sure. But if I haven't, I'm going to immediately. And I just got on my computer, and I didn't even check. I literally didn't even check. I just went on YouTube, and I see, see I type in Sierra Hall, and I see this. What, do, what, what appears? Sierra Hall covering Walk On Boy, the Doc Watson cover. Now, Sierra, you'll remember this uh, when we met. I said... Uh, that bluegrass changed my life, and it started with Doc Watson, and we had a little short conversation about that. And so, of course, I'm just going to click this. I'm not going to check anything else. It was meant to happen. Um, here we go. Click the button. <laughs> First of all, I, sw I swear, and I promise this on my life, all you guys out there that can tell people who are lying or not by their eyes or wherever their face, look at me. <laughs> I have no idea why I played that little dead part that <laughs> must have been completely subliminal because I had read the title to this before, Walk On Boy, but I don't remember ever learning Walk On Boy, but it this just happened. It just happened happened okay this is one of my favorite songs ever i love this tune she is it has a capo on the first fret but it still kind of sounds like a minor it, it almost might still be a little sharp my gut feeling is that uh sierra if you watch this put this in the comments you're just playing by yourself here did you pick up the guitar, kind of make sure it's in tune to itself, uh, and it's just kind of in between A and B flat, uh, or is this or or is this meant to be in B flat? Um, because it's just it's a little bit under, so it's going to sound a little bit off. But your basic your basic thing here is A minor, right? To E seven. 
So you got A harmonic minor, and it's got this little walk down, the A minor, A minor over G, C, F, E7, and I gotta watch it again. I think it goes D7, or D, maybe it goes F, D7, or D minor, before the E7. I gotta watch again, but it's something just like that. But basically your tonality is, is, is A minor, A harmonic minor, whatever you wanna do. Yes, I know I have a live stream tonight. I know I have a live stream. Let's keep going. You're crushing this, Sierra. Down the road, there ain't nobody in this whole wide world that's gonna help you carry your load. Yeah, okay, so it's F, E7, D minor, back to E7. Right? So you got... And then it's got this little... got that in it let's go back and get some of that let me let me kind of it's you can hear the chords changing underneath this whole time let's get some Ooh, there ain't nobody in this whole wide world that's gonna help you carry your load yeah you got jumps right up a minor to b minor very cool jump and then again you can't watch by her frets so much because he's got the capo um, and it's tuned down. It's like in between, right? So you got this A minor, B minor, goes to the C major here, right? But you still that A minor seven tonality. And then you got that, that, that nine and then that. I like that she leads in with that, right, with that on top, and then you got your typical five flat seven root flat three. So remember, C major and A minor are relative majors and minors, so all the notes are the same. Other than the, that. that. Flat seven fifth. Now what, what the hell is there? The same way you she went A minor, B minor like that, you're really just suspending that A, right? It's a very cool way to suspend that A because you get the four in terms of A, you get the nine, and you get the major six there. You see her go, you know, root, fifth, flat three, just go up. Same little push. And then, and then, uh, uh, uh. Next inversion. So, root in the bass. Third in the bass. A minor. B minor. Or something like that. Maybe she did a double step there, or two notes and not three. It, the concept is still the same. Why am I losing that? Oh, 
Oh yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah. That's cool, that's going to see. Um, uh, uh, uh. So it's like A minor, B minor, C major, going down, targeting that C, but your little blues inflection, flat three and two, even though C major is your tonality, man, C major, same as A minor, yeah, we're starting to lose our tuning a little bit, but what a cool little thing. Ah. Phrasing is slicker than it seems there. And then sliding again uh, into your into your um, your five from your flat five back in A minor, right? That's your that's what we're thinking. And that little right flat five four pull off a flat three to your root of A minor. Listen to all, you can hear the chords in there. That's when it goes to the E7, right? Uh, 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 uh. You hear it really targeting that E. Hit. up here Sierra it's just those little double stuff there piece of D piece of C piece of A piece of G just fifth and root right Love that F. To that up there. To the right. There's so much cool stuff going on here. Oh man, I love bluegrass. This, I didn't mean for this video to be this long. Instead of just the, that, that flat seven, major seven, right? Instead of just yeah. little things. Now, if anybody ever asks you, who is that, who's that boy named Brown? <laughs> Who's that boy named Brown? Tell him he's the boy that left his hammer smoking when he beat that steam drill down. Walk on board. Walk on down the road. There ain't nobody in this whole wide world that's gonna help you carry your load. There ain't nobody in this whole wide world that's gonna help you. the video froze there maybe it was supposed to um Sierra like I said to you before 
uh, Doc Watson changed my life. And it makes me so happy that someone like you, and we know there's many others out there doing it, um, are, they love that legacy and love those songs, right? And I can tell you've really taken a deep dive in his phrasing. Um, and, you know, one of my favorite things about Doc Watson, and Sarah, you're doing it like, so well and so confidently, is that he would, he would always say, who was it about? I've heard him say it about a bunch of people, but I think David Holt, um, I heard him stay on stage one time, and he goes, he knows all the fancy notes. He knows all the fancy chords. He went, to, he went to school and all that, but he never let that mess with the song, right? He's like, you might, you might take a note here, and you might take a note there, but don't you mess with that melody. Don't you mess with the tune. Don't you, don't, you, don't you slow down the breath, right? And I can just tell, you know, the fisherman sees a fisherman. I can tell that you love the music, you live it, and you breathe it, and it makes me so happy um, that uh, it's alive and well. And on a completely other note, I don't know if there's video out there, but I saw her with Corey's band uh, play a Del McCurry song. God, I can't remember which one it was, but what an incredibly cool arrangement to see that type of tune done with the full band. Go check it out. If I can find it, or better, if anybody of you out there know where it is, drop it in the comments. That's it. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for liking. Thanks for subscribing. If you can tell the vibe here is a little different and you dig it. Uh, thanks for watching. Share. Tell your friends. Uh, Sierra, that was awesome. That was awesome. Uh, I'm a big fan. It was great to meet you. I can't wait to meet you again. If you ever want to come on this channel, you are more than welcome. Let's have a bluegrass night. Like, seriously, let's do it. Like, tomorrow. Uh, or in five minutes. Um, that's it. Ladies and gentlemen, have a great day out there. I hope to see you soon. Cheers.